Yo, what is good, John? Welcome back to yet again another episode of J.I. Productions. It's your boy J.I. and I'm back at it again with another banger. Now, as y'all can tell by the background, we're definitely in a different setting today. We got Vader right here in the cut, chilling, finna go ahead. And, well, y'all don't know what we're doing um, as of right now, but so we're just gonna keep playing this little game. Basically, we're doing some weight reduction on Vader right now. So, this joint's gonna be completely straight. Nah, I'm just capping. Um, we're actually doing the Rolls Royce Star Headliner on Vader. I got two kits, total of 1,100 stars finna be in Vader's headliner right now. And that's probably all I'm gonna tell y'all as far as what we're doing. I'm not gonna tell y'all anything else, so just stay tuned for that. Got my boy Jay working on the car, man. So huge shout out to my boy, we've been talking back and forth about doing this on multiple builds and finally was able to bring the car up to drop off the headliner and i feel like this is only right to do it on this car so with that being said y'all i'm gonna you know hit a little bit of a time lapse slash b-roll for y'all so y'all can see what it's like to take out the headliner and then um after that we'll go from now then my people sin city right down the way got nikki's gtr and jake's hellcat out there the family in this joint nikki y'all can barely see it but Nikki, then you got my boy Jake over there. You feel me? <laughs> my boy Jake took the rap off this joint. He said he wasn't rocking with it too much, man. I make sure y'all go tap in with them Sin City on YouTube, man. All right, y'all. So if you're an OG of the channel, man, you know who this man is right here. What I was that? just over there talking about the Hellcat and the GTR, and then as soon as I click off the camera, my boy Ji, I look up and it's my boy Jake. So by now. Uh, right now, as you know, what I'm saying they're wrapping it right now. Nobody has seen the color. Um, I ac accidentally seen the color actually because I'm dropping off my uh, headliner right now. Hell yeah! But so y'all will see it at the meet. Well, already have seen it at the meet by the time this video goes live and everything together and stuff like that. But BTS. Sheesh! Make sure you guys tap in with the gang, man. Sin City for shit show. Just the back seat, I guess. It'd be hard if we could put it here. But that's why I was like, we could put the BYL here, because then I'll still be able to see this. Yeah, you know so what I mean? BYY, BYL and the BYL here? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, maybe like like a dot type? Or, nah, there's no reason to do that. Yeah, just the BYL. And then in script, right? So, yeah, yeah so like in like the cursive type okay. shit. Hell yeah. And then the JI. So the, the picture that I sent you was like my prototype mm -hmm. logo. It was my first one. It's the only PDF file I have of it. Yeah. Well, picture I have of it. But it's like just not as wide. You feel me? Like this is the logo itself like after it's been edited. Mm -hmm. And it's just like a little bit thinner. Okay. So like I just, you know what I'm saying? Like in the picture it kind of looks like big ass it does look, blocks. It does look thicker. Yeah. You see how like it indents right here? Yeah. Like on this here? Mm -hmm. I feel like if we could fit it here somewhere. You think that'd be better? Maybe closer to the back yeah. if you want. Because I don't think I don't say all the way back. Because once it's right here, yeah. you won't like even you won't like Ain't no point. No one's gonna know what it says yeah. back here. So yeah. pretty much I'm saying like in the middle. Yeah, in the middle. Okay, right yeah. Alright, y'all. So just a quick update. You know what I'm saying? Got the headliner hanging right now. My boy working heavy fast. So yeah, man, just updating y'all as we go. Many unbearable hours later. Yo, what is good, y'all? You do know what I'm saying? So, it has actually been two to three days since you guys saw the last clip of me dropping off the headliner. Yesterday, I actually went and dropped off my car. So, my boy Jay has had my car literally all day. He's been installing the headliner. So, today, after work, we're going to go ahead and go up to Mod Effects to pick up the car. And the headliner should be done. I can't wait. So, I'll see you guys there. Yo, what's up, y'all? So, I know y'all can't see me, man. I messed up and I left my camera at the crib. But I had to include this little snippet of the first drive home. Y'all see the roof going crazy. J.I. with the BYL on the back end, man. You feel me? Build your legacy, man. It's just a very surreal moment for me because this is something I've wanted to do for so long. And I finally, 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 finally was able to do it on a car of this caliber. I'm, I'm more than blessed, man. I'm more than happy. All right, y'all. As y'all can see, back at the J.I. HQ, man. Got my boy, Young Vader, in the garage right now, man. I'm super stoked about the headliner. You guys let me know what you guys think down in the comment section down below. 
Should I have put more stars in the headliner? Um, honestly, I'm gonna keep it a buck with y'all. I feel like I definitely could have. Ooh, let me. Uh oh. Are those the stock wheels? Wait a minute. If those are the stock wheels, then what wheels are on the car? Hmm. Well, I guess you guys have to pull it to the J.I. Wings and Cars to find out. Anyway, um, honestly, should I have put more stars in the headliner? I feel like 1100 is not enough. I'm just going to keep it a buck. But that's to be expected with me. I'm never satisfied. I always want more. So I feel like I really should have put 2000 in the headliner. I legitimately wanted the entire headliner to be covered in stars to the point where like you could see the interior one of my biggest like pet peeves with my car is that the dome lights are so small it's actually one of my biggest pet peeves with my garage the lighting is terrible so the dome lights are so small they're kind of like the airplane dome lights to where it's literally just like a small little reading light the dome lights are just so small that they don't even really necessarily brighten up the interior of the car and as you guys know i have a 2021 ss1 le and the one le comes with those sexy sexy recaro racing seats and i just feel like Whenever I pull up to a car meet, you know what I'm saying, 5% tint all around, the car is already dark, it's black, and satin hood, satin, um, you know what I'm saying, accents on the car. It's just like the car is so dark and menacing that it kind of takes away from the interior. The interior doesn't really get as much love as it should, I feel. Um, you know what I'm saying, with those red seat belts and then the Ricardo seats as well. It's just like the interior needs more attention. So I really wanted to get the stars put in the headliner so that not only, oh yeah, I got J.I. and B.Y.L. in my headliner, that's crazy. But also, whenever I have the lights on and I pull up to a meme and I got the windows cracked or whatever, you can actually see inside the car and see the seats. That was the whole point of me, um, you know what I'm saying, wanting to get the stars put in so bad because I felt like the light would actually help with the lighting quality for these nighttime vlogs whenever i'm driving the car to a car meet or whatever the case may be you know the headliner going crazy would definitely help out with the lighting but um we'll see how it goes with the you know upcoming vlogs um if i do feel like i want to add more stars i'll probably just buy another kit and uh, take the headliner out myself and go ahead and do it um just because spring is a nice little drive away from my crib so with that being said dropping the car off not having the car and then trying to get a ride up there is kind of difficult so with all that being said i just feel like it's best if i just do it myself that way a i can get some content for y'all b i can learn how to do it myself so i can do it to other people's cars if they would like it um or i could even do it to you know future builds that you know come along the, down the way now with all of this being said man I love the stars. Um, y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section down below. I feel like they could be brighter. I'm going to keep it a buck. I really do feel like they could be brighter, but it is what it is. Y'all let me know, like I said, what y'all think in the comment section down below. They definitely look good as far as like phase one of the stars, I guess you could say. It was a success. I got the logo. We were able to squeeze both logos in with 1100 stars and be able to still not have it look like spotty in the background you know what i mean so with that being said man that's actually gonna wrap it up for today's video if you like the stars give this video a big thumbs up drop a comment in the comment section down below if you're running stars on your car let me know how many stars you guys got and i'll see you in the next one peace